Uh, and this the recent research within the last decade has really demonstrated the importance of the fat cell. What we've always perceived the fat cell as is the stored site in our body. It's simply the excess material is just a place for it to be stored in our fat cell, but that's not the case. Our fat cell releases hormones and proteins and what are known as peptides that traverse or carry throughout the body. Not only that, our fat cells communicate and regulate how our brain controls energy expenditure, hunger suppression, it controls our liver and how it synthesizes and stores sugar. It also controls our skeletal muscle on how it's able to absorb and process sugar. So the fat cell is actually directly linked to diabetes and cardiovascular disease if it's in an, an unhealthy enlarged state. So ultimately, the fat cell is an integral part to the whole body's communication and what is known as metabolism. And so it's simply not a cell that we can interpret as disposable. It is quite valuable in our body and it's imperative we appreciate that. And recent research is showing the value of the fat cell as a vital component to human metabolism, to regulation of how our brain functions and how organs and skeletal muscle function. So it's important we preserve that cell but it's more important we get that fat cell back into the healthy lean state. What we see when an individual becomes obese or overweight, that cell is too large and it becomes quite noxious or harmful in the body. So the goal for any physician, endocrinologist specifically, is to take that enlarged cell and revert it back to the lean state. And proudly that's what the Xerona is doing. That's what it's been clinically proven to do at histological levels, meaning examining cells, but it's been proven at the macroscopic level.